90210. Because what happens is the teams of knights get into these free-for-all fights. The uh, melee, they call it. Am I pronouncing that right, melee? Uh, melee. It's French. The French invented the tournament, so we use their terminology. Yeah, that was centuries ago. Can't we come up with our own names like uh, Rock'em Sock'em or uh, WWF Slamboree? Well, you'll have to take that up with the French. Hey, 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 I don't want to get into no uh, French-English dispute. <laughs> then hit him up the middle with your sword. Stab! Game over. Good point. Well, the big tournament in London this weekend promises to be a dandy, some very nice prizes and trophies to be handed out by Lady Bing. Yeah, the top three guys will get some rubies or whatever, or diamonds, you know, but uh, that's not what these guys are fighting for. Not for Lady Bing's trophies. No, I hear it's for Lady Bing herself. I mean, if guys are going to risk life and limb, eh, uh, might as well be for something worth winning. You had a look at her? And quick thoughts on the church who are denying a Christian burial to any knights killed in these tournaments. You know what that is? It's a disgrace, plain and simple. These tournaments are the training ground for the knights. This is where they learn their chops and their hacks and slashes and other good moves so they can go off on a crusade to the Middle East. And who are they crusading for? The church! They're training for crusades, they have a career-ending injury, namely death, and they don't get a Christian burial! You tell me what that is! <laughs>